Hey guys, this is BBB Production and this is a video tutorial. Today I'm going to be showing you a nice little program called Clone CD. Um, just to tell you, this program does cost money, so if you aren't willing to pay any money for a program, then maybe you don't want to watch this video, maybe you do. Alright, to get this, just go to Google, type in Clone CD, Google search it, then go to the first search result. And then you'll be on slicesoft.com, um, and that is where you get it, Clone CD. And you can download the free trial or buy it, and I'm not exactly sure how much it costs right now, but yeah. And if you check the date on this video, until June 16th, 2008, you can get a 20% discount off this product. So, if you want to buy it, you should hurry up. Alright. When you download the trial or buy it, you'll have this icon. And when you buy it, pretty much all you're buying is the key code, which you may be able to get from somewhere else if that's what you wish to do. But that's pretty much all you're doing to get the full version. And you just double click, and here it is. It's a small, little, nice interface. And yeah. Um, when you go to file, it has some options, read the file, write from file, copy CD, or erase CD. But those options are also these buttons. So you read to image file, write to from image file, copy CD, or erase CD. The tools, you can go and create a log to see what your um, DVD or CD drive is doing. You can click settings and pick the language. If there's autoplay the updates, the buffer, the drive control, the auto insert notification, um, the sounds that I'll make when it does certain things. Um, you can select the skin. You could probably download more skins off the website but it only comes with one. And you can check for updates. Help, just the help thing, info, and you can go to the website. Alright, I have a CD in my DVD drive right now, so I click read um, from CD, you then select what it is, what kind of CD, and it said failed to get information because it is empty. And if you want to write, um, if you want to write a certain file, then Click browse and then you select the file and then you go to the next button. Hold on a second, let me get a file that we can use. Sorry about that. Okay, and click next. And then for this certain file I need a DVD. So you can go up here, and it'll show your drive, and then you select the speed, and then you click. You have to click on the CD. If you don't, then when you go over here, you cannot push OK. And I just clicked on the CD, and then push OK. And then sometimes this will ask you a question, like space required, space available, and if you don't have enough, then it'll tell you, and you'll have to work with it. Oh, no! And that is the sound that it makes when there's an air. So yeah, um, that is Clone CD. Thank you for watching. Make sure to rate this video and subscribe to my YouTube.